bum, bum, bum. Good times <laughs> never been so good. So good. So good. So good. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to another video. I hope you're all doing well today. Hopefully, the weather's warm enough where you live here. Um, it's minus 18. It's still cold out there and it's only because of the wind. The wind is making it really cold. So anyways, yeah, today's video is another subscription box. I got my, remember the Irish ones I was showing you? Well, I had to sign up for three months to receive that silver clada necklace for free. So I did because I knew I was gonna love them. So this is my third one that just come in. So I believe this would be for January then. But I said to Sean, I'm enjoying them so much that I think I'm going to continue to get them. I'd be really excited to see what March has for St. Patrick's Day. Oh, yeah. Maybe have some uh, free Guinness or something. <laughs> so, send you a can of Guinness. Yeah. But these do come all the way from Dublin, Ireland. So I'm loving what's in them. You do get your money's worth now. Let's have a peek here. They do tell you, because it says express post. Um, oh, and it does tell you, like it tells you the list of items on there for, for customs reasons, right? Origin Ireland. Max, so now we have Max wine. Sean and I have just recorded a couple of videos, so it's Saturday afternoon. And I said, why don't we just continue and I can get them all done and um, then I can edit and get them posted throughout the week. And then we can bake some bread after. Bake bread? Yeah. Yes, I have two, two loaves of bread on the stove proofing right now. I'm making two whole wheat, just regular whole wheat bread. And uh, then well, oh, I wanted to make some bagels and I wanted to make English muffins with my sourdough. So Erin Gobra, Ireland forever. It's sad to destroy this lovely little sticker. Erin Gobra says in your heart. Oh, no, I'm reading Erin Gobra, Ireland forever. I'm sorry, I was reading the sticker. I was reading the Erin Gobra, Ireland forever. All right, uh, this one got a bit damaged. I can't open them. There we go. I love the little thatch cottage it shows in them. Surprise! I wanted to read the list, but I'm like, no. Enjoy your little piece of Ireland. Snap and share, Ireland forever box. Oh, well, share. it says to share on Facebook and Instagram. I have to tell them I have a YouTube channel and that's where I like to share mine. Alrighty. Ooh, I love these. It's got a little card. The holiday season has come to a close. Let's share off the January blues with the Ireland forever in your heart box. Heart box, yeah. This charming box includes a beautiful Celtic themed diary and pen, perfect for jotting down your plans and ideas for the year ahead. Brighten up your 2024 with a calendar adorned with captivating images of Irish castles. Ooh. Ooh. I actually told Sean I needed to, uh, I'm writing down when I'm feeding my sourdough and I wanted a, a nicer little calendar. Maybe this will be it. Indulge in a feel good experience with a set of lavender hand and body butter and lip balm. <gasps> Made especially for you by a small family business based in Dublin and stay warm with a cozy hat. Ooh, I'm excited for that. Treat your taste buds to the delightful flavors of Ireland, award-winning hand-cooked vegetable crisps. Mm. Celebrate La Fiel Breed St. Bridget's Day on the onset of spring on February 1st in Ireland with the St. Bridget's Cross Ornament. Very nice. A traditional practice linked to Bridget of Kildare's 
feast day involving hanging bridges, crosses in the rafters or above building entryways, symbolically calling upon the saint's blessing and protection for the entire year. On the eve of Bridges Feast Day, which falls on January 31st, families would gather rushes as part of this customary observance. Mm -hmm. Warm regards, Afa. So Afa is the lady that puts these together. Whew. So this is the calendar. That's a crisp bag of crisps. Yeah. They look healthy. <laughs> Who wants that baby? Oh, healthy? wow. That's going to be nice. It's too nice to write in. There's all the castles. Most of them are in the south. Why is it that? Oh, it tells you where they all are. Yeah. October is way up there. Anyway, that's what we were looking at. That's the map of Ireland and where all the months are from. So January is County Sligo, February County Galway, March is West Cork, April County Clare, May County Cork, June Kilkenny City, July is County Clare, August is County Tipperary, September is County Dublin, October is County Antrim, November is County Waterford, and December is County Kerry. Yeah. Which they have pretty much all have towns in Ontario named after. Yes, they do. They do. It's not of Irish in Ontario. Mm hmm Wow. This is really nice little calendar. Let's see what, what they have for uh March. Oh they didn't even they didn't oh St. Patrick's Day. Of course they put it in. <laughs> yeah, so that's really <coughs> nice. And then we got the crisps, carrot, parsnip, and beetroot. Oh, I'm gonna love these. Hand cooked with a sprinkle of a chill island sea salt. Great taste. Did you wanna try them? Sure. And then this is my lavender hand and body butter. I love lavender. Oh, smell that. Look at it, it's right on the top there. How buttery is that? Ooh, look. Comment. <sighs> Beautiful. <laughs> I think I just got some on my nose. <laughs> yes, you did. There you go. Ooh, look at these crisps, they're different colors. Well, summer beets and summer. Well, that'll be the beets. Hmm, they're good. They're from Joe's farm. Can you tell that's a carrot? Mm-hmm. Joe and Sandra. Ingredients are fully traceable because they are sourced by ourselves right here in Calais County Cork. They are sown, grown, and cooked with a sprinkle of Irish sea salt on the farm to give you a delicious, crispy, savory snack. Yum, yum. These were, and it actually tells you, they were made on the 2nd of December and they're best before. Yeah. Mm. Only, mm. I don't think Canada puts kilojoules for energy on their packaging. Thought they put what? Kilojoules, KJ. Sandra Burns, Valley Curragny, Dinny Farm. I'm gonna assume this one's the lick ball. Uh, County Cork. Yes, it actually is orange. It says soft touch orange, the lip balm. Shea butter, coconut oil, olive oil, beeswax, and essential oil.
Oh, it's orange. Oh, oh that's not like that. It's got because it's got parsnip. Mhm, mm it's got parsnip. Yep. Yeah. Only twenty percent beetroot. Handcraft it with natural ingredients, Dublin, Ireland. Oh, I can smell it. Mhm. Mm no, you can smell my lavender. No, mm -hmm. I can smell it. It's an orangey flavor. The orange too. Mm, yeah. Very good. Mm hmm. What else did we get? What else? Oh yes, I remember this cross. Always used to see it. Oh, that's Saint Bridget's cross. That's Saint Bridget's cross. Yeah. Bronze gallery features gifts with the intri intricate Celtic modeling. These handcrafted uh, cold cast sculptures are plated in bronze and carefully polished to highlight the elaborate detailing St. Bridget's Cross. Isn't that beautiful? Now I have a... Whoa, there's lots of things in here. <gasps> Look at this pen. Ooh. That's really nice. Ooh. Look at that pen. Really nice. Oh yes, I did get a hat. And then I got whatever's wrapped up in here. Hmm. That lip balm is really nice. So who is this there, Robert DeBruce? I'm not sure. Oh, what else did that card say I got? Oh, a notebook. Wow. They wrap everything beautifully. Oh, this is beautiful. It says Ireland with the harp. Celtic notes. Irish harp notebook with the little... I love it. In case of loss, please return to... And as a reward, I'll give you a kiss. <laughs> it's just a little line notebook. I love this. This makes me happy. And look, I got a hat. This is beautiful. Oh, look at this camera. Oh, it says uh, Man of Aaron, 1973. Uh, Basket weave, beanie, natural, one size, 100% acrylic. And it came from Valley Coolin, Dublin, Ireland. Look at the shamrock. Isn't this nice? I have a hat. What do you think? Well, the shamrock should be in the front. Well, <laughs> no. Would it go in the front? Well, where else would it go? At the side, maybe? Oh, you're right. It goes in the front. I can a, see. It's I can. A freaking beret. <laughs> it's not a beret, he said. What do you guys think? I got me a new hat. That looks cute on you. I love it. I love it. I've got a new hat for St. Patrick's yeah, Day. I love the smile. <laughs> Let me hold all the things. We can take a picture. <laughs> Are you smiling too? <laughs> <laughs> That's for my thumbnail. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video. I was going to say it's short, but it's what, 15, 14 minutes? Yeah. I am so pleased with these. I love them. And uh, instead of going out and buying all that garbage from Dollar Tree, I'd rather put my money into a subscription box every yeah, month. I quit supporting China. I mean, I still will buy, um, buy from Dollar Tree, but I don't need any more seasonal decor or anything unless something really jumped out at me. So I'm happy to support this company here out of Dublin, Ireland. And... Makes me happy. So that's Makes supposed me happy. to be Finn McCool. I'm not sure who that is. I'm really happy with this lip balm. Mm, Want to try some? Like, it kind of looks like Conor McGregor. Put some. I don't know who it is. <laughs> Do you want to try some?
good. It's really nice. The mandarin? Shea butter, coconut oil, olive oil, beeswax, and essential oil. Mmm, it's not seen. You can really smell the orange. Oh, I love that lotion. Mm. I love lavender. Thanks for watching. And you know what? I will have another one next month for February. Have a great weekend. Take care. Bye for now. <laughs> Caroline. Bum, bum, bum. Good times never mean so good. So good.